What are the key elements in the new strategy? Well, the short version is that uh, we want to enable people to perform. And that is coming from our performance culture. We want to enhance that. The other thing is we want to stretch our, already, uh, our business model that exists today. Meaning that in our shaping culture, we believe that we can go a bit further in any existing uh, businesses that we have today. And third, I will say that innovation is extremely important for us. And we now have a foundation to continue looking around the corner a bit and see what, how to meet tomorrow's demands. You are forming two standalone divisions. Yeah. Why is this? Well, it's two totally different business models with different customers. And it's important for us to separate this and to have the right focus on each division. And also clarify it to the market how we aim to go forward with these two divisions. And that's the main, main objective why we are separating them. And what do you mean when you say that you are a people business? Well, we are very decentralized today with strong local business acumen. We're conducting our business through over 330 depots in 15 countries. Uh, we are extremely depending on our employees that goes to work every day and fulfill the customer promises that we have. And by that, of course, it's important for us to also invest in our employees and make sure that they are prepared for tomorrow's demands. And that is definitely a people business and the most valuable asset for us. Which are the most important trends and growth drivers for Cramo? Well, we have some mega trends that is supporting our business very well. I will say urbanization, people are moving to the bigger cities. That is definitely supporting our modular space business, creating flexible solutions for tomorrow's demands. Uh, I will say digitalization, that is an opportunity for us to connect with customers in more different ways and make sure that we fulfill different demands in a more fast and agile way. And thirdly, I will say sustainability. Uh, we are a part of a sharing economy and we like to drive that moving forward. So that is important things for us in our strategy. You have new financial targets, both for the group and the divisions. Can you please comment on them? Uh, firstly, now when we have created two divisions, uh, we, we also decided that we have to have separate targeted because it's separate different businesses. And uh, we think important is to show that we want to, you know, growth. So we have a top line target, meaning growth. The other thing which is important, we want to have a quality financial target. That is return on capital employed. We are a capital intensive company. And by having this as a target, I think it's also a good, uh, good signal uh, to our shareholders how we're handling our capital. And a good measure for, measurement for us also showing that we handle our capital with quality. That is the main thing. Thank you. Thank you.